So we just came from up here. We followed a quartz vein all the way across the top of the mountain, about two kilometers. We found multiple exposures, multiple samples that are oxidized. When we came down on the road here, we noticed a zone which is cutting through and would potentially pass through that uh, quartz vein and maybe have some mineralization. So you can see you have loads of oxidization here. You got sulfide staining. Uh, this is a schistose rock. And you have small, small little quartz veins. And in those little quartz veins you have pyrite. So there's a couple small little sections here exposed with oxidization. Another one here and another one there. And the interesting thing about this is you know that this carries for quite a ways because it's exposed in the road here. So there is quite a few samples here with uh, quartz all along the road here. And you can see right here, more of your showing is exposed. So obviously it comes through here. And then you have it again exposed here. So we have multiple, multiple exposures. Nothing huge in the way of mineralization that we're seeing, but we're gonna see if we can at least find a sample or two, hammer away at this, maybe find a road grab sample. It's looking like this zone of schist is uh, at least 100 meters wide along strike. But we're not finding any definite veins. Nothing bigger than a half a centimeter for sulfides. Most of the quartz we find is not fully mineralized, just the occasional speck. But it is an interesting feature to look at. We did find a sample, so let's go take a look at that. So these are the biggest samples we could pull off. You got a uh, hunk of sulfides here, iron pyrite, and that's about one centimeter thick. Not a very big sample. Another little piece here with sulfides, again, one centimeter thick. This piece is a little bit bigger. And again, it's schists with sulfides, primarily iron pyrite. And then this piece over here is the only piece of uh, mineralized quartz that we could find. It's actually the biggest one we could find. We found lots of smaller pieces like this, but nothing quite as mineralized. So I don't know if this is big enough for a uh, analysis. We'll see. Anyway, those are our samples. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. Take care.